Hello there everyone, welcome back once again as we're back in for another episode of Baldur's Gate 3 as we finally did our rest. We met with Karlak and had a little bit of drama with her and Will and nearly got our asses handed to us multiple times in fact. So let's go ahead and make a party for today because uh, most... Having three frontliners has been fun. I think we should probably slim down who's going to be taking the brunt of the attack. So, Gail, how can I help? Uh, come along. I could, uh, but your entourage is full. You'll need to make room for me first. Carlac, please. One. Sorry, Carlac, but I need a mage. Let's see. Could have Liza, which could help us. I mean, that will pretty neatly keep things having two melee and two range. But I kind of also want to have a Stelian as a bit, since we, I do kind of want having a rogue with us. Yeah, you know what? I think let's go. Well. Do I really feel like I need a Stelian? I don't think I do. I mean, sure, having ball magic is nice. Not to mention having someone who can actually stealth would be good. But I mean, at the same time, I kind of also want Shadow Heart. I think let's go ahead and bring. You know what, let's go ahead and try this party, see how well it works. I'm probably going to have to use more potions here, but eh, what else is new there? So, let's get going then. Uh, and we should also probably take a moment to head back to uh, the druid camp. Alright, let's get to work. Speaking of druid camp, uh, it's... Come on, we're going to need an upgrade. I have, well, something close. So let's see, what do you have? You have the hunting short bow. Advantage against monstrosity type. I mean, definitely not too bad. I mean, we could definitely give it to someone, I suppose. Maybe like Lysel, but I mean, it's a short bow though. Uh, shield. Uh... I mean, I guess we could equip that to Lysel since she might like it. Let's see, we have crossbows, which looks like it's giving more damage. Nothing wrong with that, though. Let's see. So that we have a maul, which basically more damage. Looks like we have the tenacity. I mean, never hurts. A halberd. Uh, interesting. We have the great club. Just simply go for the good old bonk. Javelin. So let's go ahead and might as well let's just go ahead and go for the main upgrade of just simply equipping a better weapon to ourselves. Can't sell off most of our steel, who knows, he might be grateful to have some of it. We'll keep the hand axes and gelfin still since have the feeling that ooh, actually we could give the Lysel the long bow for her short bow. That would be pretty useful. A bit more damage for her. Sword of Justice. Oh why right, we got this from from that one guy. Yeah, I feel a bit stupid now for taking this, but I mean you know what, I think having, giving a shield to Lysel might be 
a decent pickup here. Because that will, that will put her AC up to 18, which is huge. Let's see. With the A key half plate, that gives you 15. Could do the wing mail, which gives her a bit of a bonus, but that's a lot of money on our part. Have to figure out what I'm going to do with that great sword. I mean, if anything, the great, the sword of justice can just kind of like stick in our pack. Got a lot of armors which we don't really need. Let's see, Oak Father's embrace. Undead creatures and beasts. Uh, I mean, I guess we can at least. Oh wait, these are griefs. So. Well, actually, I guess it doesn't really matter too much for Izel. I don't think, anyways. I mean, it gives athletics. This also gives athletics. So yeah, don't really know what. What the lightning charges do, though. Well, who knows? My, my common units. Okay, really don't need some of these other stuffs. And I think we kind of keep the rest here. Maybe, maybe we got some. Good stuff out of it. I mean, we gave Lysel a shield. And Will and Gale don't really need the upgrades since, I mean, they're mages. Only really thing I would like is if there was like some kind of. Well, if we need to do more, then we can do some more shopping later. But in the meantime, let's head out. Okay. Uh, fine. Oh. But no, I is over here. All right. Well. Many a wise man and woman indeed. Waterdeep is the home of myriads. So let's see. Looks like it's around here. Spent a whole fleet week there with my father. What a delight. It's locked though. Of course it's locked. And I kind of wish I had a step in. Actually, no. It looks like if we go around, we might be able to find a way in through there. Or maybe just have to go into it from here. Calcified web. That doesn't sound nice. No traps, please. Some tools. Where? I don't have the feeling that can lead to somewhere. Of course, it's locked. All right. I have a feeling. And I think my feeling might be correct. Well, let's take a look. A trap. This place is more dangerous than I thought. Okay, where was that trap there? On the chest. Oh, that's lovely. There's a bellow, some barrels. Lots of stuff here, but well, anyone have an idea on how to disarm? It's ten. 
Alright, well, who has the best dex here? Please don't tell that. Please don't tell me that it's me. Uh, it's me. Great. Alright. Let's see if we can't do a thing or two. Uh, pray for mercy! Hey. Alright, what do we have? High Cliffs Blueprints. Blueprints for three impressive sounding rabbits. Oh, what do we have? Uh, where's that high cliff? There it is. Uh, let's see. Three weapons, a great sword, a sickle, and dagger. Huh. An unusual ingredient, so so. Well, they call for Susa Bar. There's only one place I'm finding a Susa tree. The Underdark. Oh, that's just simply lovely. Well, that uh, coming down here was actually worth it. In the meantime. See if we can't figure out what's going here. That I can crack that open. About, oh jeez, that's a very big. We might actually need a stereo for this, but you know what? Let's go ahead and try our hand. Hey, barbarian stuff apparently. Steel forge. Well. Speaking of items that we wanted to give Lysel. Hey, an Infernal Iron! Uh, what's this? Note. Specimen metal hardness color. Gift from. Oh. This is. So someone tried to. I guess someone was trying to test out the Infernal Iron on. and making something. But in the meantime. So let's go ahead and give that to Lysel. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. Yeah, you'll get it, you'll get it eventually. So No, oh, but it's a short sword though. So this is one D six plus four. And it's one D eight plus three. So Uh I guess We'll hold on to the Seal Forge sword and see. I guess we could actually give it to Will, but. I mean, 5. 5 to 10. Yeah, let's go ahead and give this to Will then. He could use it. Oh, but he's not proficient in short swords. Shit. Okay. I forgot that. I don't even need to give Will a weapon. He has his, uh... He has his Bind Pack weapon. So... Let's go ahead and have him do that then. Oh, wait. Hmm. Well, we'll just simply see if I screwed up later. Call to staff. Uh, I... Oh my... Okay, uh, give... Uh, well, I think you should be giving that to me there. That's just... Ooh, heavy, heavy thing. 30 pounds? Jeez. Uh, okay. No one stopped me yet. So, anything else here that would be interesting to take note of? Hmm. So, I have a. Well, I mean, I guess this is a former blacksmith place, so. Not too sure what else there is here. I think we found, like, most of the good stuff. Right away. Although I will happily take more thieves tools. Oh, definitely not complain about that. I 
will complain about picking up a random wooden bell, though. Get that shit out of here. Let's have a look. Alright, well, nothing else I can really find. Ooh, cup. Let's see if there's some gold. Always nice. Alright. Ooh, trapped a zombie tool. Okay. Nice. Well, I guess we'll see how well I can walk this. Eh, only a 10, so. Shit. There we go. Second time's charm. Can our squiddy go solo, laser? You know, break free of their master. Renegades are red. Gail? Are you over the are you worsening line? again? I need to consume some powerful magic or it may become volatile. Sheesh. Alright. Uh I guess let's go with. I guess let's go with the moon drop. Although actually, that's actually pretty useful. Let's go with wealth of power then. Hopefully, I don't need to donate any Thank more you. stuff. It is a strange experience. Each time, a new, I kind of lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. Somehow the second artifact hasn't had the effect of the first. It somewhat relieved the discomfort, but I fear my hunger hasn't quite. Uh. uh you good? You do plenty for me, more than you realize. But this cannot be remedied. <clears throat> the magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time, like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire. Drizzles. The embers still sizzle. The fire remains undefeated. I'm not certain what's going on, but nothing good. Please, I need to think. I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Thank you for the artifact. A great deal of trouble it was, too. A great deal of trouble, indeed. So it sounds like he... I don't really know what's going on with Gale, so... 